Aaron Paul became known around the world for Breaking Bad, but he revealed years later he makes nothing from the show, and with that, life's a bit. The history of Breaking Bad was pretty rocky, where the show was originally supposed to be canceled after the first season. It only kept going due to good reviews, even though the ratings were bad, but the show almost was canceled again in season 3. The change the show was Netflix, which introduced streaming in 2007, and Breaking Bad went viral in 2010, being called the first binge-worthy show. The problem was Aaron Paul didn't see a lot of that in his bank account, where even though he was paid $150,000 per episode in the final season, which came to $2.4 million, that was considered low for TV standards. That was because they had their contracts and salaries already arranged before the show was popular on Netflix. To show how crazy this is, Ashton Kutcher on Two and a Half Men, where his role was panned, was making twice as much money as both of them combined on Breaking Bad, which was loved. But this gets worse for Aaron Paul as he just revealed that him and Brian Cranston have never actually made a single dollar off of Netflix. He's saying this is the writer and actor strikes continue that the unions need to get residuals in the deal for actors and writers. He pointed out if this was TV and not streaming, he would have made $50 million on residuals so far. Life's a fill-in-the-blank with them. Trust Pro subscribe to learn something.